Welcome back, one and all, to Fire Emblem Three Houses. I am the Dark Seraph. Last time, we did a small amount of exploring around the ground. Today is Fernand, Frederick Fernand's, or Dan, that guy's birthday. Sure. Much appreciated. I'm glad I don't have to track them down. It's just something I can do. Mission. And here we have a mock battle. Uh, put the file there. I forgot to add the part. Ah, it's finally time for the mock battle. I'm eager to put my skills to use. And you, Professor? I forgot to add the part of I know a part of on part three. I'm looking forward, and I hope we can win. I wouldn't worry too much about it. If you command us as you did back in the village, I have no doubt we'll be fine. Our opponents are mighty, that much is certain. But I'm positive we can win. Hey there, did we miss our invite to this strategy meeting? No, oh, no worries, we'll just join in now. Nice try, Claude. But I do not intend to let slip our strategies. Especially when we are up against such strong opponents as you two. Well now, kind words for Miss Kingliness. If that's the case, we'd better come up with some clever schemes so as not to disappoint. Right, Princess? You're, uh, you're quite the smooth talker, Claude. You're an interesting fellow. Right. No matter the tactics you devise, we will destroy you. The best you can hope for is to learn a thing or two. And you are very well spoken, the way you enunciate your words. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with a friendly rivalry, but let's not get carried away. A rash attitude could be your undoing, after all. Well hmm. said. Perhaps your time would be better spent preparing instead of worrying about the competition's mindset. Hey now, if you two were getting this fired up before the battle even starts, it'll make it that much easier for my class to sweep up a win. So please, carry on. Right. A good point, Claude. I apologize, that wasn't my intention. At any rate, let's vow to make this a productive battle, shall we? Well, I don't intend to lose. Oh? In that case, I won't hold back. Oh, how precious. Looks like you and the students have become fast friends. Right. While I am pleased that you are taking the initiative to acquaint yourself with the students, I'm afraid it's about time for the faculty strategy meeting. Right, and you are very hammy. Ah, how time flies. In that case, I'll see you later. I look forward to assessing your abilities. I hope you don't disappoint. Right, while well, exploring the monastery. Yeah, the right stick moves the camera. I already know that, thank you. Magic, I know how magic works. Magic can work at close or long range. Battle preparation, I can equip everyone. Okay, you're an archer. I called you being an axe user. You're an archer. Interesting. Well, I don't see there being much of a point for two archers. A lancer. Lancer. You use axes. That's interesting. I'm not exactly sure how magic is going to work. Here. Forgive me if I take a little while to set this up. There are S-Class supports, but there are no children in this game. Just to try and avoid that clusterfuck.
You're a, my character is a swordsman, and that's quite fine. You're a lancer. Out of curiosity, I can't equip a lance. Interesting. I can. That leads me to question. Something. Where is my character? There we are. Can I? Yes, I can. Okay, this is interesting. Can just any unit use any weapon? We're gonna find out, aren't we? Units fall in battle. Good. I finally took out that bullshit. It is about time for the battle to begin. Our victory depends on your leadership. Do not let us down. I'll try not to. I'm sure you're already. Incidentally, I'll be overseeing this mock battle. So listen well if you want to win. I can see their movements. Oh, and the other instructors are in on this as well. And there's Claude. And Eligard. Okay. I always play conservatively when I play Fire Emblem. Always keep the units go. close by to each other. I'll cut through. What should I do? Stay focused. Only putting a couple in the danger field. Draw them in None of and your thin them out. Are required, Claude. Ignatz and I will dismantle the opposition. Oh boy. Me? But I'm not ready. <sighs> Are you making light of our new professor? If you drop your guard, you're gonna get hurt. Dorothea, will you head toward the front lines? I wish to draw the enemy toward us. You got it, Aidy. Leave it to me. Ferdinand, Hubert, if the enemy comes, stop them. Leave it to us. Although I could do this on my own. I'm sure. <laughs> Clearly not. Or Her Highness would not ask me to watch your back. <laughs> Hubert seems kind of snake-like. That's it, draw me! Something tells me the jacket's not supposed to be like that, but I could be wrong. Think about these. That won't kill, but I'll put her in killing range. I don't want to deal with that archer. Archers cannot attack in close quarters. 
for whatever reason. You think they'd have a dagger, but no. I don't like the mage, so let's get rid of you. My, my. The new professor seems very capable. Should I have held back? Well done, Teach. I may have to take this seriously after all. Like I said, I like to draw them in. I take things slow and draw in my enemies. No, the box art even shows the sleeves being outside his arms. That's just a weird detail, I guess. Not traditional, but... Stay vigilant. Not terrible. I've lost. The new professor is quite a commander. Next time, bring your friends. Okay, you need some heals, but I don't have a healer with me. I'll assist him. I'm gonna have you bring up the rear. Let's use the forest to set up an ambush. I'm counting on your support, everyone. If they're waiting in the forest, we do well to take a detour. Right. I planned on going around. I kind of have to. You've got a training bow. You've got a hand axe. I like how weapons were handled in Fates a little more than this because it did away with durability, but it forced you to actually really plan out what weapons you want to use. Silver weapons might do a lot of damage, but they're going to cripple your stats in the long run. Focus on putting the wall down. And just take this slow and steady. You bring up his rear. Are you really gonna fight two houses at once? <laughs> An impressive display of confidence. Victory is in sight, Black Eagles. Do not let up. I'm just taking things slow and steady. That's it. Come right on in. And I got you away from that barricade. That was a mistake. I'm not ready to take them on. Let's draw them out. That's it. Come on over. Force you two over. As I move in. Use a voluntary. Get to the 
time being, we're gonna end this turn. Because I got those people right where I will need them. Excellent. Chum right on in. You've fallen for my trap. Ooh! I don't like that. He's gotta go. Proceed with caution. Cut him down. My goodness. The leadership of someone with actual battle experience is... Well, I was as good as useless. A threat eliminated. Intermediate seal. Hey, you didn't compliment me like that when my class won last year. Hmm. Do I detect a hint of jealousy? That's not where I wanted you. Oh no, that is where I wanted you. You really should have seen this coming. Of course I was gonna gang up on you. I'm the son of House Iyer. How did I fail? I must need to train harder. Who's next? Dimitri gotta level up. I'm getting stronger. I can feel it. Ooh, Felix is out. Okay, she's hits pretty hard. Too easy. Damn it. I failed. Apologies, Your Highness. That's not what I wanted to see. Got a level out of that. Another step. Let's be careful. Oh, you're a healer. <laughs> Quite helpful. Oops. Your princeliness. You got a thing for Edelgard, right? Come on, fess up, you'll feel better. <laughs> Claude, please. This is no time for idle banter. Your defenses are wide open. And that didn't get to him, huh? What a shame. I'll find a better way to ruffle him up next time. <laughs> Oof. I do not need you taking out my healer. You leave her alone. Damn it! Miss, come on, dodge it. Well, there goes my healer. Ah, the new professor is rather strong. I suppose I'll have to call it a day. That is that. Another level for Dimitri. Getting... I must have let my guard down. I guess that's a loss for the Golden Deer House. Dimitri, it's time. We can finally settle the question of who's stronger. Very well. I accept your challenge. With you as my opponent, I won't hold anything back. I would expect no less. 
I would say he's physically stronger, but she is swinging that axe around with no problems whatsoever, so there's no telling, really. Oh, jeez, you're going after him? Hmm. Wait, combat arts. That would put her down. But I need to find a place where I can... I'm gonna move here for the evasion. And use a voluntary. I'll wait on the combat art. Not good. Use caution. Another level for Dimitri. I will get stronger yet. I'm sure you will. Forced to retreat. Well, things will only get tougher from here on out. Two on one. in my own infirmary. Each battle, a chance to grow. That was fun. And I got another Volinary. All right, that's that. The winner of this mock battle is... The Blue Lion House. This victory is the result of everyone's hard work. Thank you, my friends. You did well. They did indeed. Rivalry of the Houses. And the MVP was Dimitri. And your motivation is maxed out. I don't know what that means. Well, I'm going to end this one here. Thank you all for watching. Ah, damn it. I always forget about that. Professor, I've been looking for you. Mm-hmm. I was hoping we could all share a meal together. It could serve as both a victory celebration and a post-battle analysis. What do you think? I'm invited. Of course. Why wouldn't you be? Come now, Professor. We can't very well celebrate without the key to our victory present. He's right. He really is. We were only able to win because we had your help, Professor. Yes. Compared with that boar who knows nothing save frontal attacks, your tactics were nearly decent. Felix, you really ought to stop picking fights with His Highness. Don't worry, Ingrid. I encourage all to speak freely. And I must agree that the Professor's tactics were truly extraordinary. Nathan, you say so. Oh, sure. But today was exhausting. I'm so hungry I can barely stand. To be honest, so am I. Let's head to the dining hall. Together. Professor, I'm sorry to intrude, but you don't look too happy for someone who just won. Uh, is that so? Hmm. Well, I understand how hard it can be to accept joy sometimes. I'm sorry for prying. I know we only just met, so this may be difficult for you, but... I'd love nothing more than to share our happiness with you. Joy can be so fleeting, after all. We're all in this together, so I hope you will consent. I'm sure the rest of the class feels the very same. Well, come along, Professor. Let's enjoy the fruits of our labor. Okay.
Your work with the students was remarkable. I can see Geralt trained you well. Thank I do you. hope you were able to use the occasion to bond with the students. I did. I'm so happy to hear it. Nothing would please me more than if you used this coming year to grow closer still. Of course, the mock battle was mere practice. The real fight is the battle of the eagle and lion, which will take place during the wyvern moon. You are expected to properly train your students so as not to humiliate the academy during the long-held tradition that is the coming battle. As for today, I have called you here to tell you of your mission for the month ahead. Uh, give me a second. Sorry for the cut. Dog was going crazy. My neighbor is at the porch. Your class is to dispose of some bandits causing trouble nearby. Oh, good. Bandits. Those affiliated with Garrig Mock Monastery have a moral obligation to help those in need, regardless of social standing. I have Students no are no with exception. That. Each month before the newly birthed moon departs, each house of students must complete their assigned mission. You shall work to complete the task at hand alongside your students and report back to the Archbishop before the deadline. Understood? Yes. I will soon provide you with the necessary details for your first mission. If I told you now, I expect you would only forget, and I despise repeating myself. I can sense something special within your heart. I have high hopes for you. Bandits, they say. Oh, hey, Sothis. Do you recall when we first met? You shall not fall so shamelessly again, correct? No. Have you no words for me? Do not tell me that you are shocked to hear from me! It's just a little weird to hear a voice <laughs> in my head. You ought to know that I am all... I, I, I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. Right. this nonsense. All I was told was to kill as many noble pipsqueaks as possible. No one said anything about the Knights of Dan Saros being on our trail. You have proven yourself worthless, distracted by something so trivial. And I we haven't you would achieve your goal to stop who, who is this? But now a child of the Knights former captain is in play. How interesting. Hey, this isn't what I agreed to. Hiring a mercenary as a professor. What was that woman thinking? Are you listening to me? How do we finish this? You die. What? Underestimating the knights was an amateur mistake. One you will pay for. The road to eternal torment awaits you all. Now I must locate your replacements. Get back here! Uh, damn you! Yeah, because I'm going after you. 
Okay, now I'm going to end this one here. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on Fire Emblem Three Houses. As I do probably a little preparation, school bonding, and preparing to go kill some dirty bandits. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph, signing off.